According to technical analysis, the firm bull market that Bitcoin has found itself caught within throughout January and February has officially come to a close, as the benchmark crypto has now declined below a critical support level that was an integral part of its bullish market structure. One well-respected crypto-focused economist is now noting that the crypto's break below this level is likely to lead it significantly lower before it is able to find significant support. On the flip side, if bulls want to rekindle the dying bull trend, it is imperative that they recapture BTC's position above $8,500, although this may prove to be an arduous task as its technical strength degrades. At the time of writing, Bitcoin is trading down over 3% at its current price of $7,600, which marks a notable decline from daily highs of $8,150 that were set yesterday when bulls attempted to catalyze some upwards momentum. This attempt failed, however, subsequently leading BTC to plummet below its key support at $7,700, which has appeared to invalidate its firm 2020 uptrend and has opened the gates for it to see significantly further downside. Alex Kruger, an economist who focuses primarily on cryptocurrency, spoke about this breakdown in a recent tweet, telling his followers that it marked a firm end to the recent 2020 uptrend. Many analysts are quick to point to the cryptocurrency's macro uptrend as a reason why investors shouldn't get too concerned about short-term downtrends. Despite this, Kruger believes that BTC's macro outlook is growing increasingly bearish, referencing a thread from his alt account in which he explains that its status as a risk on asset places it in a precarious position. Unless bulls somehow garner an immense amount of buying pressure that invalidates the ongoing downtrend, it is highly probable that Bitcoin will see further near-term downside.